how to make a narcissist fall in love with you. This video is for educational purposes only. Using this information for practical purposes could be considered highly manipulative and it is likely to make a narcissist fall in love with you against their will. How to make them develop a deep romantic and sexual attachment to you. How to make them very attracted to you and begin to love you. Making a narcissist fall in love with you is actually very simple. Although first we must understand what love is like for a narcissist. Narcissists don't experience much emotional depth. Their emotions are very shallow. Their idea of love is very superficial. It's based on what exists on the surface. Your physical appearance. How you make them feel. What you can do for their image or reputation. It has nothing to do with you as a person. It's not about connecting to you. It's about using you for their own needs. A narcissist will never experience real love, but in their minds, that's what they think it is. They think they're in love with you. By following the information in this video, you won't really be making the narcissist fall in love with you as a person. Because you will be changing who you are. Real love exists when two people are able to be themselves. When two people are able to be vulnerable with each other. Which is something that a narcissist can never do. And it's also something that we could never do around a narcissist. Which is why no narcissist will ever experience real love. But this is as close as it gets for them. And I will show you how to do it in this video. To make a narcissist fall in love with you, you have to do what they did to you. You have to mirror them. You have to appeal to their ideals and be everything that they like or are interested in. Mimic the way they think and feel. Mimic the way they act and behave. Mimic their mannerisms until you become very familiar to them. while also keeping enough distance away from them. When you get close to the narcissist, they will get bored. They will begin to lose interest. But if you distance yourself enough, it will keep them chasing you. The narcissist does everything they can to get you attached to them. And if you don't let that happen, they're forced to attach themselves to you to try to pull you back in. They become fixated on you. 
it keeps them chasing after you until it becomes an obsession until you preoccupy and fill their minds to a troubling extent because by mirroring them it makes them feel like you are a part of them it makes them see you as an extension of them something that they cannot live without and they will do whatever it takes to get that part of themselves back which is why the quickest and easiest way to make a narcissist fall in love with you is by mirroring them appealing to their interests or ideals being everything that they want to see you have to get to know what they like and then be that agree with everything they say act like you're on the same page but then distance yourself because as soon as the narcissist thinks they've got you they're going to lose interest narcissists always want what they can't have they will do whatever it takes to grab your attention but once they've got it they want they will lose interest they will want nothing to do with you everything they do is designed only to get your attention it's not designed to keep you around because they're not really interested in relationships they're not really interested in anything deep or meaningful they just want attention they just want something to feed their egos so all you really have to do is give them what they want be everything that they would want to see mirror their interest and ideals but don't show too much interest in them don't let them feel like they've already got you because narcissists instantly lose appreciation in anything once they feel like they've already got it once they feel like something already belongs to them it instantly loses its value and becomes worthless they only see value in things that they don't already possess the truth is that narcissists don't really like people who are interested in them as soon as they know you're interested as soon as they know they've got you that's when they lose interest in you because deep down they hate themselves and they think that anyone who likes them must be a loser it must be someone who isn't anything good because in their minds if you are worth anything you wouldn't want to be around them you wouldn't be talking to them whereas someone with self-worth would believe that the opposite is true they would see it as though anyone who is interested in them must be an amazing person because they love themselves they see themselves as someone who is a person of high someone a person of high caliber would gravitate towards so to make the narcissist fall in love with you you cannot show too much interest in them because that will only push them away that will only make them see you as something worthless or insignificant for even desiring to be involved with them
when you distance yourself from the narcissist, it makes them feel like they have something to prove to you. They have to win you over. No narcissist wants to sit around reflecting on how worthless they really feel. So they will do whatever it takes to prove to you that they are something great. When you distance yourself, the narcissist will chase after you. And this might make you want to give in. But as soon as you do, they will only lose interest in you. They will no longer decide to be around you. You have to continue being distant forever. Because as soon as you show interest in the narcissist, they're going to lose interest in you. It's a really sad way of existing. And their relationships are really meaningless and pointless. But this is just how it has to be when you are involved with a narcissist. They must always feel like they don't have you. They must always feel like you don't belong to them. And that is what will keep them chasing after you. But at the same time, you have to continue mirroring them. You have to be everything that they want to see will not actually be in theirs. It makes them feel like you are a part of them. Like you are the missing piece of their puzzle. Something they've been looking for their entire lives. But as soon as you give yourself to them, as soon as you give them the missing piece, that is when the puzzle is solved and there is no desire or need for them to continue their investigation. There's no more mystery. So they will lose interest in you. To keep a narcissist in love with you, it has to be a never-ending game. A never-ending puzzle. You have to be something that they can never comprehend or understand. You have to be something that they can never figure out. Thank you for watching. I hope this video resonated with you. Please like, comment, share and subscribe. Click the bell icon to receive notifications for my future videos. Check out the new Narc Survivor website at www.narcsurvivor.co.uk where you can read my blog posts, book coaching sessions and join a support forum. If you would like to donate, my PayPal link is in the video description. Coaching inquiries, you can email me at coaching at narcsurvivor.co.uk. Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you soon.